North hosting Holman at the doghouse. Second half, Huskies by six, pass inside to Evie Dreger. North leads it 25 to 17. And the Huskies turning up the pressure on defense. Nadia Horn with the steal, makes a move, converts the layup. She had 20 points. North wins by 20, 57 to 37. Oliva Strom and Emmanuel Lutheran both saw their winning streak snap this week, so an important duel in the Dairyland tonight to get back in the win column. Anna C. setting the stage with the national anthem. She did a great job. It's the Lancers on the move early. Pass to Paul Schreinenbeck. Aggressive take, hoop, and the harm. Emmanuel leads 5 to nothing, but the Cardinals waste no time tying the game. Ethan Carlson from the corner. Beautiful shot. Emmanuel not afraid to drive. Ethan Sado streaking to the basket. But Emmanuel also hitting from outside. Daniel Hine open up top. That's good. And Emmanuel leads 14 to 7. The game tightens up late, but the Lancers win 47 to 39. The Cloverbelt Conference doing a lot of rescheduling right now. A lot of shuffling teams have had a lot of games that they're going to have to squeeze in now before the playoffs start in just over two weeks. The Regis Girls stepping out of conference to host Pacelli. Ramblers up by five to start the second half. Ashley Chilson from the corner, it rolls in. Same sequence, Chilson deflects the pass and then gets the steal, misses the first try, but gets her own rebound and puts it back in. Great effort, doing it all. And the Ramblers were thieves all night long. Other end, Katie Andrews tips the inbounds pass, breaks away, easy layup. Regis outscores Pacelli 31 to 14 in the second half, and the Ramblers roll 52 to 25. Independence and New Auburn both playing good basketball right now. Moving quick in the first half here, it's Aliyah North from distance, giving the Trojans an early lead 5 to 1. And looking to add to that lead, Morgan Berg in the paint, good for 2. But the Indies come alive on offense after that. Amaya Ives takes the shot, connects on the jumper that cuts into the deficit. And then a little bit more from the Indies. Aubrey Pranchinski lets it fly. Zeke Connor with the bucket following. And the Indies go on the road and get a big win, 59 to 26. Neighbors battling for bragging rights here. Shatek and Bloomer. First half, Blackhawks ahead 6-3. Bulldogs with Maggie Tim driving in. Good for two. Closes that gap down to one. But the Blackhawks with an answer. It's Sierra Siebel. Her three-point shot from the corner is good and it adds to the lead. More from the Blackhawks here. Abigail Iverson taking on the D, and she's going to get the turnaround to go. Bloomer with the big win tonight, 61-38. to 38. 